If you have a timber front door, the chances are it'll be fitted with a rim lock, which comprises a night latch on the inside and a key cylinder on the outside. To replace the key cylinder, you'll need to remove the night latch. This may involve removing three or four fixing screws, depending upon the night latch you have. The fixing point may be on the front or the side of the night latch. Once the fixing screws are out, the night latch can be eased away from the door and slid off the bar that connects it to the cylinder. If the night latch is fixed to a mounting plate, you'll need to remove that too. Unscrew the two cylinder fixing screws and then gently pull the cylinder out of the front door. Depending on what type of night latch you have, there may be a back plate that comes loose when you remove the cylinder fixing screws. If there is, set this to one side ready for refitting. Now compare your old and new cylinders. You need to make sure they look the same and the flat bar that connects the cylinder to the night latch is the same length. If it's too long, you'll need to cut it to size using a hacksaw. If your door has a door pull that fits around the cylinder, slide it over the new cylinder before you fit it. The new cylinder goes in the hole from the front of the door. Secure the cylinder with the new fixing screws, remembering to fit any back plate or mounting plate that you removed earlier. The fixing screws may need cutting down to suit your door thickness. Then reattach and fix the night latch and check that the lock works properly before you close the door. For more ideas and know-how, visit DIY.com.